So I used it to sacrifice. Bam! There we go. Patatas Origins TV. Well, hello, mga kapatatas. This is a story of how I luckily brought down. No, actually, you know what? No, this was not luck. This was pure tactic. This is how I brought down a Tiger One hide and shitter. And his name is Aizen Sosuke. If you're not familiar with who this is, um, this name comes from the, um, uh, the Bleach character. I think it was the first, no, it was the third arc. Well, he, he already revealed himself in the, during the second arc. But anyway, if you don't know it, check it out. Um, there's a new season of Bleach airing right now, and it's <clears throat> it's pretty cool. Um, apparently, it's it's the the Quincy's uh, were not yet extinct, and Ishda is not the last um, is not the last Quincy. <laughs> It's a very interesting turnabout of the story. Anyway, let's get back to the game here. Um, nothing much has happened really. If you can see, or as you can see, his life, his HPs are pretty much high up there. Ours are the same, but what's new? It's a hide and shit team. What do you expect, right? So, as much as possible, what I do is, you know, test the water, see what kind of shield it is, and whether if I can penetrate it or not, right? So the first shield he had on was a watering can. So when I first tested it, the good thing is finally the developers now had the inkling to at least but you know reveal what it is. Like <clears throat> before, that was a very bad cheat for these hidden shitters. You, know, you hit them and even though there's just one shield then but you don't know what kind of shield it is whether it's just this one or you know whatever uh actually no it's not this one this one is definitely not it but sometimes when there are multiple shields like the pumpkin and these guys have these shields and then you've got the watering can <clears throat> and then you know instead of when you hit them uh, make an informed decision like do you want to continue? Do you want to commit? Or whatever, right? Uh, you're at a loss. You're just, you know, waving at the... <laughs> waving on the air or something. Alright, so... Here goes. Uh, this time around, I figured, you know, it's pure water, but... What the hell? Let's go ahead with it, because I didn't want to waste my birdie. And, um... So I did that, did a summon, um, he did get his, he, he did want his three pure waters, but I think it was worth it, because then I was able to pull this out, I pull out the maidens, and then as expected, um, you hide and you shit, right Aizen? <laughs> anyway, good thing my, um, my cucumber eyes came in clutch and then I just used the shield on here uh, just in case he attacks which he never did right because that's the kind of play he does so again here's the shits and you can see here fear uh, well there it is that's what I got right but then I realized you know what hey it's not uh, it wasn't a uh, reflex, so it's safe to proceed. But unfortunately, there was too many confused cards on mine, so kind of got wasted. But whatever, right? So again, here we are. Blood Moon is already out, and still he's still shitting here. So <laughs> shitting. Okay, so again, I hit one, and I figured, you know what? Uh, I'll commit. I don't want to waste what I have with the birdie, but I just tried not to use this one anymore because at the very least, you know, I wanted to avoid more confused cards like this. So, um, okay, so he's got, he already has a ton of pure waters here, but he's still playing the hide and shit game right there. 
Uh, surprisingly, he chose not to use the Kotoro and see what his chances are. Right. So, anyway, midline is dead. Mine is just about dead. But it's a good thing it wasn't. So I used it to sacrifice. Bam! There we go. And it was a very good sacrifice, I must say. Um, then I hit him with the little owl and finished him off with the cupid. Well, he didn't really die off because of that, but good thing there was a blood moon out. Um, <clears throat> and there he went. He was gone from this world. Off to the nether world he went. And here he goes. This guy has nothing else but shit. No attack whatsoever. Just shits, right? So he's applying all the shits that he can have, right? Um, and on the other hand, I'm doing all the attack that I could have. Now that was a mistake on my part. I thought my life was still, or my HP was still more than half. That's why I used the the uh, the Kestro, but really I should have used the other one. Uh, at least it was greater damage compared to Kestro, but hey, it is what it is. So here he is. He loads up on all of his. Well, actually. I don't know why, but he decided not to load up on the pure waters, but that was one of his biggest mistakes because he doesn't really have any reflect shield, and here I finish him off finally with this one. Bam! There we go. Nice and crunchy. Alright, I hope you like that. Um, please share this video if you did, and subscribe for more videos like these. Alright, I'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.